channel i hope you guys are doing good today so in today's video i am going to share with you guys some really amazing brown toned nude lipsticks so mostly these are going to suit a lot of medium to dusky skin there are beautiful beautiful brown shades in here that is going to look amazing on your brown skin so yeah i also am going to talk about a lot of lipsticks that are very underrated maybe you guys haven't heard about this brand maybe you guys haven't tried this lipsticks and you guys haven't heard you know they are a lot underrated i would say so and also another thing most of these lipsticks are under rupees 300 so really really budget friendly their lipsticks are very very comfortable to wear i actually am wearing this lipstick from chariot and this retails for only 170 rupees and just look at the shade it's beautiful so yes we are going to talk about a lot of nude lipsticks so let's get started also if you are someone who's new to my channel thank you so much for watching this video i hope you like it here i hope you like the vibe I hope you like the content anyway if you end up liking the content you can hit the subscribe button along with that the notification bell as well so let's start the video now okay starting off the video we have this beautiful lipstick that i just recently got and it's from chariot and the shade is something that is going to flatter all skin tone does not matter if you're medium skin dark skin dusky skin it is going to look beautiful on everybody this is like a warm toned brown nude but at the same time it's not too brown it is a lipstick that is going to look different on every skin tone i feel like and it's very comfortable too it's not one swipe pigment though you do have to you know swipe it twice or thrice to get on the full pigment but it's super natural it looks beautiful and flattering it will go with any eye look it is good for everyday basis as well if you are looking for a beautiful warm tone nude that is going to look flattering on your skin tone that is affordable you can totally look for this shade in particular which is dutch caramel so moving on to the next lipstick we have this lipstick and this is the non-transfer 12 hour stay lipstick and it is from the brand Perpa. I don't know how to pronounce this. I think if that's how you pronounce it, it's known as Perpa. And it is in the shade, let me just look it up. It is in the shade 16. This is a deep brown toned nude, I would say. This does not look that nude on me. But again, if you have dusky skin, this is going to suit you so well. This is going to look absolutely gorgeous on you. On medium skin, it definitely pulls more brown than nude. But if you have dusky skin, this is going to look more nude. So the next lipstick is actually a dark, dark brown tone, neutral brown, I would say, lipstick. Now this definitely does not look nude on me and it is in the shade Coffee. It is from Swiss Beauty and this shade is beautiful like beautiful in a sense that it's very goth like and it's very different it's not like your usual brown toned lipstick it's exactly the shade of dark coffee i would say it goes with the name it is going to complement dusky dark skin so nicely i just can imagine you know dusky skin beauties rocking this lipstick even on me it looks good but obviously i'll have to use apply a little bit more neutral makeup then it's going to look beautiful but yes i absolutely love this lipstick the formulation of this lipstick is amazing it's very creamy but yet it's matte it's not patchy at all as you can see by the swatch itself the next lipstick we have here is again from this new brand that i discovered which is the pear pa and this lipstick is beautiful again just look at the packaging of the lipstick comes in this uh, kind of like i don't know the switch kind of lipstick and this shade i would say is much is going to suit much more of a light medium skin tone it looks a uh, super peach like on me it's definitely it definitely pulls a little bit more on the peach side and again i apologize for my makeup to be honest i did not like how my makeup looked in today's video it's definitely not looking good i was trying out an eyeshadow palette that did not perform well anyway coming back to the lipstick i absolutely love it the formulation of this lipstick i would say is very much you know satin like but it's not completely completely matte it's very very comfortable to wear though like i love wearing this lipstick and i have been using it every single day i would say 
so yeah now let's move on to the next lipstick that we have and this is from studio west now i have talked about this lipstick a couple of times but i did not mention it any of my new favorite nude lipstick video so here it is i love it so much you guys know if you have seen my channel you guys would know that i talk about this lipstick all the time it is in the shade spice and it's an absolutely gorgeous warm toned nude lipstick and it is going to look flattering on dusky skin as well you just need to use a brown toned lip liner maybe and then it's going to look amazing on you again this is a lipstick that i feel like is going to suit a variety of skin tones light medium dusky skin so the next lipstick we have here is from Iba Cosmetics. Iba Cosmetics is really an underrated brand and this lipstick is in the shade Truffle Candy. This lipstick is not exactly a matte lipstick, although it says it's matte lipstick, I would say it's much more like a satin lipstick where it's not completely matte but it's not too glossy also. It's very very comfortable to wear. This is actually a a beautiful warm toned nude that again is going to look beautiful on dusky skin as well and along with that if you have medium skin tone again you're going to love this these lipsticks are very very affordable and i love the quality of iba lipsticks iba lipsticks definitely have a variety of you know nude lipsticks so you guys can go ahead and check it out so the next lipstick we have here is again a deep brown nude now again on me this lipstick is looks more brown because i have medium skin tone but if you have dusky skin this is going to pull more nude nudish brown i would say just look at this shade it's beautiful again the formulation of this lipstick is also really good this is actually my first time trying out purple lipsticks i normally do not use purple lipsticks i don't know i need to check these ones out because they are very comfortable, long wearing, at the same time just look at the shade, it's gorgeous. This type of shade matches with all skin tone I feel like, even if you have spare skin, you can totally give this one a try. And this is again is a lipstick that I love to pair with my lighter toned nude lipsticks because I feel like it looks so nice with my light toned nude lipsticks and it is a beautiful beautiful brown toned nude. So the next lipstick we have again is from Perpa and it's in the shade 21. Now this nude lipstick is a little bit on the light side. It's not exactly a brown toned lipstick. It's a little, it has a little bit of that pink peach undertone to it and I love it. Now this one actually washes me out just a little bit. I need to use a good brown toned lip liner with this lipstick and this actually looks super super good when I use a brown toned lip liner. So if you're getting this, use your favorite brown toned lip liner and I'm telling you it is going to be your perfect lipstick. Now the formulation of these lipstick, as I have told you guys, this is a new brand that I just tested out and yeah, the formulation of these lipsticks are really really good. Good. they are almost like velvet matte super comfortable so the next lipstick we have here is from Nea I have talked about this brand once on my channel and I wanted to mention this because of the deep brown lipstick now this again looks super super deep on my skin tone but if you have dusky to I would say you know a uh, dusky to dark skin you're going to love this as a nude and I like to use this again with my lighter toned nude lipsticks because this complements those nude lipsticks a lot. And yeah, as you can see, this is how the lipstick looks like. The formulation of this lipstick, I would say, is much more on the satin side because it's not completely matte. It is not transfer proof too. So I just wanted to mention that in case you guys were wondering if this is transfer proof. It is not transfer proof, uh, unfortunately, but again, it's very, very, very comfortable to wear. And I'm sorry for my notification alerts. Um, yeah, so anyway, in the next uh, lipstick we have here is from Insight and this is in the shade Bougie. So this actually is a beautiful, I would say much more of a mauve brown toned lipstick. This again, sometimes it washes me out. Sometimes, you know, if I am a bit tan, it can wash me out. But this is a nude that again looks flattering on every skin tone. And this type of nude I like to wear with a nice, you know, black or brown smoky eye. I feel like 
a neutral black or brown smoky eye looks best with this type of nude this lipstick from inside one side it has a gloss and one side it is a liquid lipstick so it's like a two-in-one lipstick so the last lipstick we have here is from cuffs and lashes and it's a beautiful warm brown toned nude now as you can see by the swatch it almost looks reddish on me it pulls more reddish and that is again because of my skin tone this is a lipstick that is going to look different on different skin tone like on me this lipstick pulls much more on the reddish brown tone side but if you have dusky skin i feel like it is just going to look like a warm brown toned nude lipstick this one does not look nude on me but i wanted to mention this because i feel like it is going to suit so many dusky skin beauties also this cuffs and lashes liquid lipsticks are amazing they are very very comfortable to wear they are also transfer proof like non-transfer proof i always say transfer proof yeah so they do not transfer is what i mean and they are comfortable to wear they are ultra, ultra matte i would say they do not have any shine to them they are long lasting and they are very very pigmented so if that's a lipstick that you want to check out you can go ahead and check it out i'll provide all the links in the description box down below and these are all the lipstick swatches that i just showed you guys so that was it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know which one was your favorite lipstick shade or maybe which one wasn't your favorite let me know about it in the comments down below and i love to hear your guys thoughts and opinions as well and yeah i'll see you guys in my next one Bye bye